has the old coin season indicator finally triggered welcome back guys it's crypto rocco from rockstar trading channel and in today's video guys i'll be giving you guys an overview of my thoughts on old coin season i'll look at some key old coins i'll be looking at my for altcoin indicators that I look at to know whether to buy altcoins or not, whether to go aggressive. I'm always trading altcoins, but whether to go aggressive on altcoins or whether to not be as aggressive on altcoins. So I'm going to go through those four indicators, guys, and I'll give you guys an overview of the altcoin market. If you are interested in trading altcoin markets, I know this video will slightly be longer than my usual 5-10 minute videos. But I highly recommend you watch it. I'm sure you'll learn a lot from it. So you might want to, you know, pause the video and come back and watch it again but i'm sure you'll learn something from it so without further without starting the video before i start the video I recommend you watch my altcoin season indicator video you'll get a, a better understanding on what i'm talking about but i'm going to touch on those before uh, to see whether they have been triggered or not before i look at some of the key altcoins i'm looking to trade uh, if you've already joined my facebook free facebook group you're already aware of some of the altcoins i'm looking to trade i'm going to cover some new ones and i'll be talking about some of the ones that I'm looking to buy uh, in the coming days. And if we get a really good setup, I might even take a setup live. So guys, uh, let's start the video. Before I start, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button to not miss a video. Uh, I really appreciate all the support. I've already reached over 5,000 subscribers, so I really appreciate your help. And the more likes and subscribes I get, it motivates me to provide you better content. So I'd really appreciate if you enjoy my content, hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification button as well. So let's start the video. Bitcoin, so the first indicator I use is Bitcoin. So in simple terms, when Bitcoin rallies, guys, altcoins suffer. When Bitcoin goes sideways, altcoins do well. And we've seen it before, altcoins got hammered in this Bitcoin rally. It had some flashes during these consolidations but not very well but so recently guys altcoins have been doing well few altcoins have had some nice rallies so we're going to talk about some of them i'll also share with you my thoughts on whether we're going to see an altcoin season like back in 2017 i'll talk about that my general views at the end of the video so altcoin season uh, indicator first one you would say you would have to say yes it has probably triggered it because bitcoin is not breaking out and going up it's sideways now so we can say that yes it has triggered and it could probably be bullish for uh, altcoins but do bear in mind guys what i'm looking i'm bearish on uh, like uh, bitcoin i did take a short position guys i think it was here my my pullback strategy that i use uh, below this green zone i told my people that are in my educational group you can check that out as well uh, i've got full crypto trading course and you know when to buy when to sell I'll leave the link below if you want if you're interested in that and I've said if, if, we, if we can't get above this green zone and close above it we are bearish if you're like long-term trader and you can't trade as much as I do you can use that strategy and not look to buy Bitcoin unless we break and close above here at the moment we probably could be forming this falling wedge is falling wedges work quite well in cryptocurrency and you can see which level is stopped at the 236 level I keep going on about this level if you break out we can have a nice little rally but overall guys i'm bearish and i'm still in a short position i was looking to buy this zone is here it's some fibonacci confluence here but we'll see if we get there so that is my thoughts on bitcoin so first indicator you can say there is a tick second indicator uh, is the bitcoin dominance chart that i use and if we look at the daily chart guys it is pulling back but are we gonna trend change by trend change i probably mean break below here so and we form where is my give me two seconds i'm not used to using this platform uh do something a higher low and a higher high so this is this is what i want to see so this hasn't really triggered yet we have seen it happen previously and if you go back and study when uh, bitcoin dominance was going down altcoins have had massive rallies we are potentially at a resistance zone um, i was looking at slightly higher i think this one's the 618 level as well but this zone could be potentially very good for uh, where altcoins could bitcoin could have a stop so this is a 550 percent level so this is a level where if bitcoin breaks down here guys uh, we could have a i'm not saying an altcoin season but at least some altcoin rally 
And I mean, I'm sure I've shared my thoughts before on altcoins. I'm, I don't think we'll ever see an altcoin season like we had in 2017. We are going to see where altcoins rally, but you know, you could have bought any coins back in 2017 and you would have made money. I don't know if you'll ever see that. The, this was like a new thing. No one knew anything about it. They were just buying coins that go up. I'd had, I've had coins that went down 20, 30%. I kept hodling and they went up. That is complete no no in trading. You know, I didn't know my risk. It was just a crazy market. I, don't, I, I do think there's going to be altcoin season and the proper good projects are going to rally and go, go massively higher than what they are. And I'll, I'll make a video of my top five or top ten coins below a dollar that I'm looking to buy. Uh, do check that video. I'll probably come out tomorrow or yeah, definitely over the weekend. So that is my second indicator. I wouldn't say it's triggered yet. So that's probably a, a question mark. The this one's the opposite basically of uh, the Bitcoin dominance is the altcoin dominance chart and you can see that is breaking down here so we need to see a trend change so these two indicators or one indicator has been triggered this is another indicator I use it's the altcoin the full altcoin market cap and it, it, it it's been it's trying to break above that level and um, I'm looking for it to I was looking for it to pull back here this is when I'd start buying altcoins but I don't know if it, if it might just start changing changing the trend here that's why I've taken some tra trades like EOS REM and I've posted them you know posted signals in the Facebook group and in the educational group of coins that I'm looking to buy so this is exactly what I'm looking to see here guys simple thing I want it to get above this zone um, I was hoping for it to buy it here, but it could let it could change here and then start moving higher. So this is what I'm looking at. I want this to be above that that zone. So we need a trend change here as well. So this is another one, which is probably another question mark around. So this is my third indicator I use. So out of the first three, we've only had one that meets our criteria. The second one hasn't. And the fourth one is the Ethereum chart. So Ethereum chart, guys, I've made a video a couple of days ago about Ethereum. This is a, probably another question mark. It's trying to break above, but it can't. And the more importantly, I look at this chart, which is the Bitcoin and Ethereum chart. This is probably the most strongest indicator I use. And when I, whenever I see this pumping, I look to buy, buy altcoins. And we had some really nice rallies. I don't think we've seen four green days, you know, uh, I don't know when's the last time we saw four big green days. So it is very bullish for Ethereum. We've got a massive uh, candlestick pattern here, guys. But it's not, I mean, probably below it's a stronger zone. But again, this could be a zone where we could start turning away from. The volume is decreasing, so we need to see some volume coming in. And um, yeah, this could be a zone where we could turn higher. So if we can see close higher above here guys this could be very very bullish for uh, altcoins and it, I mean you can see where we stopped the 236 level if we can get a close above the 236 level I would be very very interested in an altcoin and this is another I mean some people will say it's already gone above it but I like to see a higher low and a higher high for me to start being interested so uh, altcoins if you are in some of the trades I've made a call and if you check out my video on top five altcoins to buy in september eos has performed brilliantly i highly recommend you watch that video uh, you might want to take some profits and see how it plays out i'm still in them guys the litecoin ethereum guys yeah, i'm still in litecoin i think litecoin might not work as well for me i maybe should have taken more profit i'm still in this uh, i'm still in ren good old ren i don't know if you guys are aware of ren i thought i had ren on my charts Yeah, Ren's not looking very good for me, is it? It needs to stay above here, guys. Otherwise, this might be a loss for me. So, altcoins are pulling back. I have taken profits on EOS, uh, as you guys are aware. I bought EOS here. If you check my previous video, I'm going to look to get in again. Um, but EOS could potentially be looking to change trend. So these are some of the coins, guys. Another coin that I'm in, um, let me just check. So Ren is, and I'm, I'm a bit disappointed with Ren, actually, that Ren hasn't worked. I am in KuCoin as well, but I don't think you can chalk 
KuCoin on here so I won't be able to chart KuCoin another coin I can't remember which coin it is that I'm in uh, it will come to me I'll post it but that's uh, altcoins are pulling back but um, with the Binance rumors guys that's what's happening another coin that I'm really interested in is actually Binance because Binance is so beaten up you can see where I bought it we rode that rally and it's pulling back like crazy and Binance coin and Litecoin were the leading indicators for the bullish move this year so we need to keep an eye out for, like, uh, for Binance we'll see if it can make a double bottom and rally from here or spike down and push up because this is a very 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 uh, important zone for Litecoin so we need to watch out for this level in Litecoin this is a very very important level for sorry Binance coin this is one coin I'm watching another coin I'm probably gonna buy is Doge so you can see Dogecoin does this quite a lot we bought some Doge here and that rallied and Dogecoin came to this level once twice three four you know fifth time and it seems to bounce from here so it's a very low risk reward trade if you buy it a bit below and then put your stop loss below and see if it does what it does what it's done again it's not the best technical analysis but you know this is something that can work so there's a few coins that i'm looking at and looking at keeping my eye out for i'm going to post again when i see charts that i like it's very difficult cryptocurrency markets change so quickly you have to be very quick to know which ones to buy which ones to sell so i've given you my four indicators i've given you my indicators that for altcoin season and i said whether the trigger has set up or not we're very close to it i don't know whether we'll get that or not all you can do is get in positions and see if it works you can be aggressive and look to buy now or you could wait for a confirmation for these indicators to play out i'm going to keep you guys up to the updated when they change so to end the video guys i want to talk about my overall thoughts on on altcoin market so first of all i don't like i said at the start of the video i don't think we'll ever see another altcoin season like we did in 2017 that's because it was new money people were just coming in and buying like crazy and there weren't many as many altcoins as there is now so you know money money was going into the same ones like vert coin verge but now there's too many so i don't think everything can pump and i think a lot of altcoins will go to zero but some of the good ones um that they can go really well the ones that i like you know poly link rvn is a coin that i like bat these some of the coins again i'm not saying they're the best ones and i'm not a cryptographer or a, or, a, or a cryptocurrency blockchain expert but these are coins from my research ethereum i like eos these coins can pump hard and obviously bitcoin is my favorite and you know i've got some bitcoin that i'm gonna write to 100 or to zero um, i love bitcoin i'm not i'm not selling the, that bitcoin uh, it's not really a trading it's an investment and i recommend you watch my you know people watch my breakup videos but they don't watch videos like you know learn from my biggest mistake trading versus investing they're the most important videos that you know that if you watch the videos of mine that don't get views you learn a lot more about trading because these are the videos people don't watch they want to watch you know breakouts and why i sold why i bought and th that those are the videos people are more interested in so i recommend you go watch those videos especially this one i highly recommend you watch this one at least so guys then um, what do we think the altcoin season will be like i think it will be more uh, minuscule so we're gonna have you know a couple of weeks of altcoins pumping so a there was one coin that done really well yeah you can see it had a massive rally massive breakout start of this year um eos is a coin that pumps a lot um that's why i'm in this coin I still um i've taken profits you check out my top five coins for this month this this works i'm, I'm keeping an eye out for link you know link is pulled back a lot link could be turning up again you know if it gets above that moving average so there's a few coins i'm looking at matic and there's another one it's not actually gone down as much as some of the other coins it's still trying to stay above that red zone so there's a few coins that i'm interested in if you subscribe to my channel guys i'll keep you guys up to date i'm back in the uk now i mean apologies for a couple of my videos with the yellow tint and slow internet i'm back now with my own desktop and i can trade better for you guys and keep you guys up to date with what is going on so thank you very much for watching this video i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel i know it's a bit of a longer video but you guys can see you can learn more in these longer videos and and hopefully i've helped you guys learn a bit more about how i'm looking to trade all eyes are on bitcoin i mean i always say this bitcoin is the king 
and um, I'd like to end my video with one thought that could possibly play out and uh, it is that we might not get the proper altcoin season until Bitcoin breaks into new highs so we're gonna have mini altcoin market rallies if you want to call it but we had the altcoin season around this zone Bitcoin was at its all-time high at its peak I think if Bitcoin can break out here I mean Bitcoin could easily pull back it could easily do this I'd want it to do this because with Bitcoin I'll have my most of my money in Bitcoin I want to buy as much Bitcoin as possible but if Bitcoin breaks out here and then you know it goes to new highs I think that's when we'll get the proper altcoin season so that is my thoughts on it and um, what do you guys think comment below and let's have a proper discussion and uh, also I'd like for you guys to comment below one coin that you want me to look at uh, I think I'm going live on Sunday go do a live stream any questions you may have any coins that you like I want you guys to comment below and I will have a look and then um, if you're interested in learning more about my trading how i trade you can join our cryptocurrency trading educational group and i've got some big things coming uh, in the future probably by end of this year so stay tuned for that um a few people have asked me about trading signals and um, i'm quite busy at the moment with my own trading with forex uh, trading gold and wti it's been quite stressful so um i don't know maybe if if we do get a crazy altcoin run then i'll definitely create a signals group and then um, I can help you guys out looking at some of the trades I'm looking to tra uh, looking to take so you guys can benefit from it so at the moment I've got all my energy in well mainly WTI this is the main market that I trade but I also look at other other coin um, other markets as well but this is probably the most uh, market that I trade the most so thank you very much for watching this video i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button i really appreciate you, all your help um, and i might bring some different content uh, coming up in the future that i might make a video of my, myself you know that i sold my house to buy bitcoin and and some entertaining content i think people enjoy those sort of content more than this you know a lot these are very technical videos that I don't think a lot of people can focus and learn uh, these this sort of videos they enjoy more about the fun stuff so I might make some fun videos and you know make a video about me selling my house to buy Bitcoin and, and stuff like that so anyway thank you very much <laughs> I'm, I'll just keep I love talking uh, so I carry on and blabbing so I want to get, get away from the video just to summarize I looked at four indicators one is Bitcoin is consolidating I want to look at Bitcoin and altcoin dominance charts. I want to look at altcoin market capping and uptrend. And I want to see Ethereum Bitcoin doing well. I want Ethereum to do well, which shows that altcoins might get a rally. And I also talked about my thoughts on altcoin seasons and some of the coins that I'm looking to buy. So thank you very much. Smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification button. And I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much and go Bitcoin!